Yeah, yeah that You're one. An I hate straight people. <laughs> <laughs> I do. The first one was good, but then they just oh, they just died. It's so bad. Okay. Hi everyone. How are you? Hey. Oh god, I'm so glad you guys are amazing. I love it. Okay, so I just wanted to say that of all of the te our theme is teen scream and everything, and I literally was like, I hate teenagers. I have no idea what I'm gonna talk about. But I do know this. I thought back on all of the teen movies that I watched and I actually started to get upset because the slutty ones always die. <laughs> the slutty ones are the ones that have the most street smarts. Like they're the ones that get around the block. You know what I mean? Like the virginal ones and the ones that are sweet they just sit at home and crochet and shit. Like how do they survive? You know what I mean? So that's just my thought on it. That's all I'm just gonna drop it right there for you. You can hear that. Um, my mom is also just like Anastasia. My mom or no, who was it? Was it that had like all the family, the moms, they were like like the whole family. Like my mom is the one that got me watching horror movies as well. But she loved the old movies, like The Mummy, The yeah. Wolfman, Creature from the Black Lagoon, all of those things. And her movie that she made me watch that I fell in love with was Them. Does anyone remember that movie? <laughs> okay, for all of you that are not old and like me and my mom, it is a movie about huge radioactive ants that leave the desert and go into the sewers of Manhattan or Man of, of LA. So it's an LA horror movie, which everyone needs to watch. It's black and white, it's awesome. And all you hear are these weird noises and the girl goes, ah! That's literally the whole movie you just saw. It. I just gave you the whole movie. So thank you, I'm an actor. Um, where's my agent? Um, so the other thing that, uh, what else did I want to talk about today? Um, one of the things that I truly, okay, this is what I'm talking about. Okay, so I had this little boy. I call him my boyfriend. Chill out. He's five. Um, <laughs> he's not my boyfriend, but I've known him since he was like six months. Um, and I teach early childhood development on the side. So I teach zero to five-year-olds. Okay, so what do you do with a zero baby? I will tell you later. Um, it's big. But he's now five, and I knew him when he was six months. And he's a sponge, so he's taking everything in that he hears, okay? And some of the stuff, I don't know where he's getting it. I was babysitting the other day, and his little two-year-old sister was upset, so she's crying. And he's like, Joey, what it? And I'm like, okay, chill out, kiddo. Can you take a deep breath? And I was like, oh shit, he did it. Like, I didn't think he was gonna take the breath, but he did. I was like, okay, good. And I was like, don't mean you need to go potty? And she's like, yeah! And so I took her to the bathroom. And he's in the other room, bedroom still, they share a room. And he's like, why won't you just stop? And I'm like, chill out, kiddo. Take a deep breath. <sighs> it's just that she's pissing me off! And I went, Tommy, we do not say those words, okay? And he's like, fine. And I was like, take a breath. <sighs> It's just, I don't know why she's doing, she's pissing me off. And I go, Tommy, we said not to say that word. And he goes, I didn't say it. I said this, I said the clean version. I said it with an asterisk. <laughs> <laughs> He's five. And I'm very much convinced that he will be a serial killer. <laughs> he will be on America. Like, he will be that kid. He'll be like the Ted Bundy of like little kids. Yeah. No, he's like so, like he was like, yeah, pst, off. Uh. Uh, I'm gonna say that now all the time. And if someone's like, don't cuss, I'm like, uh uh, that's the clean version. I said the asterisk. Okay. <laughs> so, anywho, uh, yeah, so one of my other favorite movies is Carrie. And I actually, you know, I don't know how, but um, I was able to uh, direct a horror film myself, okay? And um, actually, the lead of that girl is right here. She started it. And I'm very thankful that she let me do this because I was kind of living my every single dream of horror movies. And we did like a shining homage in it. We had our zombie homage in it because it's a zombie movie. But then I also had a moment where she kills the zombie. And I was like, can I just like, can we just do blood and stuff? And she's like, yeah, sure, whatever. She had no idea what I had in mind. It was a kiddie pool and like a gallon of blood. And she's like, so I got a Carrie moment. Yeah, so Carrie's probably the only teenager that I want in my life because she's amazing. And I love her dirty pillows. That's my time. Thank you, everyone. Have a great night.